If you want to give your users some extra feedback as they're filling out forms, one cool thing you can do is use input valid and change the outline color, though this does come with a drawback where empty fields are considered valid, that is, unless they are required. Now that all of these are required, you can see it's not working. This does have another drawback though, because if we add an invalid state to this, now they're all gonna turn to red because if they're empty, they're considered invalid. The powers that be in the world of CSS have realized this is an issue. So there is another option now that we have, which is user invalid or user valid and user invalid. And the advantage of these two is they will not work unless the user is interacted with them. So as soon as I actually write my name here and I leave the field, now it gets the valid state. And I can do the same for an email address. If I leave, you can see that it is invalid, but if we have my email at email.com, it's now coming in as valid. And my password is only gonna be valid if I have enough characters in it, because if we look at my HTML here, I do have a minimum length of 12. You can even add patterns here and other stuff